Call him. What the hell? <laughs> you have a foot fetish? You have a foot fetish? Go online and look for someone who can take care of that. I don't want you touching that. He like your toes. I got some lotion for my toes. <laughs> Who gonna do something? I don't do that argument shit. <laughs> gonna get beat up on this bus. <laughs> yeah, this ride is loud. <laughs> I didn't give you permission. I don't want to They can't make us get kicked out of the bus. <laughs> She like her toes getting touched. She ain't changed her seat yet. Can't, can't be playing with her toe jams, man. Oh, she said masturbate your toes by yourself. That's a new shit to show you to her. I won't give up a window like this. Kenny, you're a beach. You don't need to beach you, bro. Bye, Zach. Oh, no, Zach, stay okay. What? I'll stay with you guys. Zach, you just want to see what's going to happen. I didn't do anything. No one did I didn't anything. do anything. I was in the forest, but I'll stay with you guys. Mm -hmm. Can I stay? Sure, to be. I guess that's a yes. You can go, so. Uh, so, you guys are all buddies, and I get that. And y'all want to go to school, and I get that. And y'all want to have your music, and I get that. And I don't complain about that. I want you to know there's 200 drivers in the school district, and 199 of them will take that speaker away from you. Do I? Do I ever jerk you around about it, other than to say, please turn it down a little? He's I'm trying to let you guys have your days in high school. It's the best part of your life, trust me. Hopefully. I don't want a problem. I gotta tell you that the front two-thirds of this bus will not ride back here because of the drama. And you the, the F-bomb. Look, look. I think you're probably a decent human being, but this this cool act, what cool act? It, it's what you're putting on right now. Oh, this I really You don't ask. think everybody here sees this? TJ, don't act like this one. They're not going to say anything races. to your face. What are you yeah, talking yeah. about, bro? Come on. Bro, you need to get out of here. You're trying to say my friends are fake. I don't need to get out of nothing. Bro, you're trying to say my friends are fake. I'm the guy who was here to help you. Hey, bro. You're trying to say my friends are fake. You need help. I'm the guy. No, I don't need your help, bro. You did? Let me off the damn bus now, You did? Turn off, bro. Get the fuck out of the way, guys. Or what? Or if you hold me against my consent, I can sue your fuck ass. Oh, 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 bitch. Oh, what, what, what? Oh, You're not representing where I'm good here. You don't want to make a mistake here. If you do not move out of my way, bro. You need to, you need to not make bro, a mistake. You're giving yourself permission to behave this move. way. I'm asking you to listen. Move out of my way. I'm asking you to listen. Oh, I fucking hate sit down. It's fine to hate somebody. Oh, you're annoying, nigga. I'm trying to eat breakfast and everything. You Your are. Your life is inconvenienced right now, You're right? trying to say my friends are fake as shit, bro. Get the fuck out of my face. I didn't say that. Yeah, you did. What you're implying, you what dumbass. You, hey, I didn't imply anything, and what? I didn't okay. call you any names, so okay. why don't you lay off the names? Because I can't, because you're a dumbass. I think you're dumb. You're not going to be riding the bus very long with this attitude. Okay, then why do you always come back here and start something? You did not the same I started. Thing. I drive yes, the bus. Yes, you came I back started. here for no reason. No reason. Yeah, what was the reason? I got it all on tape, dude. What reason? Playing music? We're playing music. Said, Stop no, talking. And we said, No music. one's talking. Listen, you play the music. I'll try and calm down here, okay? I'm not a perfect human being. But you play the music, and then you yell over the music. No one was yelling over the music. Dude, no one was even I sit 40 feet away, and all I no can hear is you. No one was even talking. No one was even talking, though. All I can hear is you. Alec, was anyone talking? He's not going to get in this. No. See? He wasn't talking. They're not going to get in the middle. What did he just say? He said no. So <laughs> apparently he just did. Oh, okay. Are you inconvenienced? What the hell does that mean? 
<laughs> oh, your high school student, you don't know what it convenience me? No. Am I jamming you up? Cause you're yes, you are. Me Actually, up. you are jamming me you're up. You're jamming me so up big eat. time. I'm trying to eat. I'm trying to drive a bus. Well, this was your decision to sit back here and no, try to start something. No, it was something. that thing in the front of your okay, head. Okay, well, then go sit going. your thing in the front of the head up there and go drive. Okay? That's easy, isn't it? It is. That's all I'm trying to go to class. Like, this That's is, what this I'm trying to do. I don't want to be late. You're going to have problems. The rest of you guys are all right. I want to blast you Hello, Hi. Good, good. Oh, you want to start up there? Yeah. On a normal day, this Dallas County bus driver would have a monitor on board. Somebody to help with Xavier, a mentally challenged and bipolar middle schooler. But on this January day, the monitor couldn't make it. Within minutes of pulling away, Xavier acts up, moving around and shouting obscenities. The patience of the driver, Janet Pitts, wears off. I'm stopping this and get them. Oh, oh, oh. Xavier starts rapping, only to later throw a can at Pitts. Don't do that no more. Did you hear me? Don't do that no more. Did you understand? Now back at the wheel, Pitts continues to voice her frustration. Weeks ago, we set out with only this tape in hand. No information. We didn't even know who the family was. But when we found them, we found out they didn't even know that this had happened. Don't do that, no mom! She's screaming at him. For the first time, Xavier's mom, Claudia Nava, is seeing the truth about what happened nine months ago. She's going back. Nava reported scratches on her son that week, and a county employee followed up, but never told Nava the driver admitted to choking her son. It makes me really mad because you would think that they would want to um, let the parents know, we're good, besides just telling me we're going to handle the situation or it's been taken care of. Nava knows her son can be violent. She requested a monitor be on board the bus for that very reason. I want everyone to understand that he's not acting that way just because he wants to. You know, there's more to him that's going on, you know, and he just can't express himself. That if we have a student on a bus. Dale Kaiser with the National sign. Education Association says this isn't the driver's fault. Blame the system. It's been stated, documented, everything else that there always should have been a monitor with this particular student on that bus. The county disagrees. There is nothing that was written that said that a monitor had to be on that bus with that child. That's not true according to the Special Education Department. Documents obtained by News 8 show there was a request made that there should be a monitor on the bus at all times due to this child's aggressive behavior. But getting that help isn't always easy. There are only 150 monitors for all 4,500 Dallas special ed students. Hiring more costs money the district doesn't have. The district pays for the monitors. So you're not going to get any more monitors? We may not. Documents show dozens of times where special ed drivers were forced to take off without backup. But that didn't help Pitts' case. She was terminated, only to appeal her decision. Meantime, oh, Nava's children. still not being clued in. Why? Educators say they have to protect personnel matters by the book. But shouldn't they have called the family and said there was a choking incident on the bus? I... More than likely, you would have thought that there might have been a, a discussion. I really feel that they failed my son. Emails and notes show some higher ups in the district thought so too. I mean, it says get this driver off a DISD bus, and this is the director of transportation. But the board just didn't feel that way. When the board reviewed the information that they had, they they came with the the decision that that was final. So she's on a bus driving today. She is still a bus driver, yes, ma'am. Hold that thought. The incident happened in January. Pitts was fully reinstated to drive in April. Now, seven months later, only after we start asking questions and prepare to run a report, things change. Last week, the board called a special meeting to terminate Pitts from the county. 
She resigned before that happened. For the Nava family, though, that doesn't change the past. And God knows how many other incidents have happened. Tapes on board the Dallas County buses often don't work. County documents prove it. The VCR is out of order. The tape is broken or even missing. If it is bumpy, with the older technology, the, the tapes themselves could eject. The county is aware of the problem and plans to upgrade each bus with better technology at the cost of about a million dollars, something the superintendent says is a must after an incident like this. One of those is, is too many to have where we can't review it. I'll see you tomorrow, okay?
Mm-hmm. 